I got this. I have nothing to worry about. Hopefully I'll be fine. I wonder if they're gonna like me. What if they think I'm not smart enough? Is my fit professional enough or is it too casual? Hi, good morning. Come in, how are you? Thanks, I'm good, how are you? I'm well, thanks. So you came pretty hurt early, huh? Yeah, I, don't know, I was a little nervous. I don't want to make sure it wasn't late. Yeah. So yeah, you know, a lot of people come early on their first stage because they're so nervous. Okay, good. Yeah, and this is my first yeah. time taking this highway route, so I just yeah, wanted to make yeah. sure I don't miss an exit or anything like that. For sure. So this is the first lab that we have. This is our new space that we just started working on recently. Yeah, nice. we have a bunch of new equipment. So you can spend a lot of time or you'll spend a lot of time just doing little experiments and working on stuff here. But if you have any other questions, like don't be afraid to ask anyone or to come to me or ask someone and I'll find someone even if I don't know the answer. Okay. So this is our second lab space. If we ever have like parties or stuff, we can have like a BBQ here. Oh, nice. And then this is back where we started. There are some bathrooms right over here. Oh yeah, I'll take you to your desk. Let's okay, go. cool. This is your new desk. You'll be working here for the next little bit. And this is your company laptop. Oh, I brought my own personal one. You shouldn't use your personal laptop for work anyway. We have oh, okay. For you. <laughs> Do I get to keep this when the internship ends? <laughs> no, no. Oh. Well, if I get a full-time offer, do I get to keep it? I mean, you could talk to the manager about it and see what they have to say. Okay. You can browse through it and get yourself acquainted with it. Um, the manager should be in about like a half hour, 45 minutes max, and then he'll go over everything with you. Besides that, do you have any other questions? Uh, no, no, I'm good, thanks. Okay. If I have anything, I'll, I'll make sure to ask. Okay, cool. Great to meet you. Right. Have you a good day. So excited to finally be applying my engineering skills in the real world. Enough theoretical stuff. Looking forward to finally starting making some real money now. Hopefully, I don't screw this up. You know, even if I do, I'm like just an intern anyways. But you know, no, no, I can't have this mentality. I'm gonna turn this internship into a full-time offer. Hi, Tamer. I'm John. It's nice to finally meet you. You're gonna be learning a lot on your co-op term. Yep, I'm excited. How are things going with your laptop so far? I'm pretty good. I set up my new work email here so far. Uh, I'm just trying to set up Slack as well. Okay, good. There's a few software you need to be comfortable with. Here we use Slack, G Suite, SolidWorks, and a few other programs. Oh, what's G Suite? You know, like Google Docs, Google Sheets, and Google Slides? Oh. Oh, obviously. Come on, Tamer. Why would you ask such a dumb question? Now, Slack, most of our communications are on various channels. Make sure you keep your notifications on because there's more than 50 different places you'll be getting messages from. For sure. I'll, I'll set it up right now. Are you ready for your first project, Tamer? Yeah, uh, I just finished setting up my email and installing Slack. Okay, what you want to do next is install SolidWorks, connect it to AutoCAD, log in with your email to see all of your different files. Then use Jira and a few other applications in order to make sure you know how the project's going. Uh... Once you're done with that, we must keep track of our bill of materials. We do that using Arena Solutions. You'll definitely be creating a ton of change orders and change requests, so it's super important you keep organized and up to date. Do you have any questions? Yeah, I can't really seem to find the download button on SolidWorks' website. Oh, do you have access to our Jira G Suite mainframe? SolidWorks should automatically download once you have access to it. Uh... Okay, email our IT team and they should give you access pretty quick. I have to jump into another meeting right now, so I'll let you figure it out. Oh, okay. Makes sense. Okay, before I forget, can you come to my office in 15 minutes? I got a bunch of forms for you to sign. You want to see me? Yeah, come on in. So I got some paperwork for you to fill out. Okay. So first of all, we'd like you to fill in this. This is your non-disclosure agreement with the company. Okay. Secondly, for payroll, I need you to fill in this so you get paid the end of the month like everyone else. Okay. And cool. finally, I need you to fill in this. That's your emergency contact form. That way, if something goes wrong, we can contact your family. Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, we just hired him as a driver. Uh, I, I say that? I, no, he did. I said you've been requested. Yeah. Well, I'm sure you can convince Dennis. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This pizza's pretty good. Man, but these guys are just talking about their other coworker. Maybe I'll just pretend like I know what they're saying. Mmm. Mmm, okay, that, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, I'll just keep nodding and smiling. And hopefully they think I know what they're talking about. Amplitude modulated radio. So if you wanted to make a receiver, for AM radio, you build a peak detector. 
So we just get the, the broad features and maybe the zero crossings. How many meetings do these guys have? I was exhausted after just one. So we can measure speed. So when you do the envelope detection, do you guys have a favorite algorithm for that? We apply to be when does my manager do any work if he's always in meetings? I wonder if my coworkers understand everything that's going on in those meetings. Corresponding, measurable. Why do they have so many abbreviations? Like, I'm just supposed to know what everything stands for? <sighs> okay, I'm, I'm, I'm getting distracted. Let me just figure out how to do this whole presentation thing. Hi, I'm Tamer. You Ankit? Hey, my name is Yankin. Uh, so John told me to come and talk to you. I'm the new mechanical engineering intern. Okay. You told me to just, you know, get to know a little bit about the electronic side of the product. Okay, yeah. So here, like, mostly we do the research stuff. Okay. And new development. Yeah. No, what's edge computing? That's what we are doing here. Edge computing? Wait, what? This is kind of going over my head. Oh, I have, like, on the electronics, I don't know much about edge computing. What is edge computing? Edge computing is, you have, like... Okay, you know what, Tamer? Focus. Just try to understand what he's saying. Isolate physical world from the real, let's say, cloud or software world. The real world and software world. Okay, got it. So, in our case, our device is like doing edge computing in mins. Oh, here we go with this edge computing thing. I don't remember ever learning this in class. My prof was just teaching me how to take triple integrals. And handle efficiently. That is what edge computing. Okay, okay. Let me just ask him a question. So, you know, I can seem smart. Did you learn that in school or did you just learn it here at work? Uh, like part of the electronics and uh, oh, yeah, part, part, part of Oh yeah, he definitely thinks I know what I'm talking about. Okay, time for me to head out. Or wait, would it look bad if I leave this early? Should I just sit here a little longer? Uh, okay, my manager is still in his meeting. So I'm gonna just leave. Yeah, I'm gonna just head out. It's been a long day. Hi, what's up? Hi, uh, I'm just gonna head out. Do I give this laptop back or? No, no, you can take it home and then give it back at the end of your term. Okay, I'll get full time, don't worry. Yeah, and yeah, then I can keep for it. sure, 100%. All right, uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, then. for sure. All right, okay, I'll bye. see you today. All right, let me just stop laughing. Hi. Well, pan to her, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. You're gonna be learning a lot on your co-op term. You're not a co-op though, are you? So this is our office space. We have some offices here. We have some workspace here as well. Yeah, we have a lot of space here too. So we have this space as well. You have a lot of desk space. Hey Tamer, is that project done yet? Oh shit. Formula that we have up there. You guys use like formulas a lot? We're serious here. We use formulas for everything. Mallet doesn't take care of Even it. personal relationships. Okay, so... Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> All this cool stuff to work with. Whose car is that? Uh, this is the CEO's car. He actually likes oh, to nice. like work on it. Oh, nice. And Does he ever himself? let any of the interns drive it? Oh yeah, all the time. I hope this kit was entertaining and educational and give you a better understanding of what you can expect on your first day as an engineering intern. If you feel a bit unprepared for your first day and want a place where you can fill in your knowledge gap, then you should check out brilliant.org or sponsoring this part of the video. As a mechanical engineer, my software skills are pretty weak. We didn't learn much about computer science fundamentals in my major. So Brilliant's hands-on computer science course has been super clutch in teaching me the basics to advance concepts to help me become a more well-rounded engineer. They have thousands of interactive lessons on topics like advanced math, AI, data science, and neural networks. They're really any STEM student's best friend. To try everything Brilliant has to offer free for a full 30 days, visit this link or click on the link in the video description. The first 200 of you will get 20% off Brilliant's premium annual subscription. Anyways, that's it. I'll see you in the next one. Peace. Thank you.